Hello, Earth Signs. This is going to be your June 2019 prediction reading. We're going to get into love and see potential outcomes for June. Your feelings, your partner's feelings, their actions, all that good stuff. All right. If you need to book a person with me, make sure you check out the link in the description below. You'll be able to go to my website and book your uh, payment. Then after that, hit return to merchant. You'll be able to go back to my page and enter your questions or book your time, okay? So we've got some cards flying out here. Way too many, but we'll take them. Too many for the spread anyway. So your energy, no, your partner's energy, I'm sorry, is the Four of Swords. So they are, in a sense, maybe taking a break from you for some reason. They're kind of like laid back from the connection in June, all right? We have the Page of Pentacles. So your, this is you, Earth Sign. I don't like you in this light. The Page of Pentacles is not really your best energy, but I do feel like you're trying to make this person some sort of offer here with the Page of Pentacles. Their energy is the Six of Wands, their next action towards you. So if you are dealing with someone, Earth sign, who's been closed off to you or they haven't really been talking to you, they haven't really been like um, dealing with you for some reason, I feel like that energy is coming to an end because whatever offer you're making them this month is going to make them come out of this Four of Swords energy. I think they were in the Four of Swords energy because they were waiting for this offer. They were waiting for you to come around with it, okay? So this definitely could be a soulmate or a twin flame because there's a lot of soulmates and twin flames waiting on the opportunity to be together uh some of you it could be a fire sign or an earth sign like yourself okay your energy is the two of wands so even still and this is why i don't like you guys in this energy because the page of pentacles is someone who can be like playing games all right the page of pentacles could be someone who's like here look there's something shiny over here but they're not really serious all right this that's why i'm saying because the two of wands is here so it's still telling me that some of y'all are stuck between two people okay some of y'all have a choice or a decision to make the two of wands is about growth so you do want to grow with this person i feel but i feel you're still hesitant even though you're making an offer you're still hesitant here the outcome card is the lover's card yeah this is a choice some of you may have a choice between a Gemini and someone else. Uh, this is definitely a lover's triangle. So be careful for the cross watchers who are dealing with earth signs because I feel like there's earth signs making offers, but they're still hesitant. They're still not all the way sure about who they want to be with. This is definitely a soulmate though. I feel personally the earth sign would benefit greatly from being with this person. Um, I don't know why there's hesitancy. Let's see what's going on with this two of wands. Why is the two of wands here for the earth sign? Why is the two of wands? Thank you. King of wands. So some of you are stuck between a fire sign and someone else. It could be an air sign, fire sign and an air sign. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, but there's a new beginning, Ace of Cups in the Temperance card, some of you may be a Sagittarius, yeah, in Hierophant, so I feel like you're going to wind up with this person, I think that's why you're making them an offer, but I think there's still going to be some waiting period here, especially with the Temperance, so I think that if you're dealing with an Earth sign, or even Earth signs yourself, Taurus in particular with the Hierophant, um, I feel like the, 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 your partner could also have a third party, though, to Earth sign. It doesn't have to be you. I'm getting that it could be either one because you could be seeing this person as someone who has two people. Okay, this could be a fire sign who's doing this to you. So it, take the energies either way. Okay, guys, it could go either way. I am feeling that. However, there is going to be a commitment between you and this particular person. The Four of Swords energy tells me they know this. This could be your high priestess right here, divine feminine energy, because they already know there's going to be um, a commitment, but they're just waiting on you to make up your mind or to accept if they are going to take the offer. I really feel like this is vice versa, too. I feel like someone's doing this to the earth sign, like a fire sign may be doing this to an earth sign, particularly Taurus is coming up, but any earth sign, Virgo or Capricorn, okay? So there will be a commitment with this person, Ace of Cups, Temperance, and the Hierophant. Some of you maybe three months from June. So July, August, September. Um, some of you, it may even be sooner than that because um, I'm doing this in May. So it could be July for some of you um, or August, okay, summer months. But basically, the earth sign to me in this particular spread is hesitant. Someone is hesitant in this connection because of another person. All right. This is definitely a soulmate energy. The Hierophant is as high as you can get as far as soulmate. It trumps pretty much. 
I mean, the lover's card, of course, has its weight, but the hierophant, as far as commitment, stability, lasting love, lasting relationship, the hierophant beats all that out, okay? It's, it's like the trump card to all of this. So I do feel like even though someone may be resisting the connection or someone may have another person, eventually you two will wind up in a committed relationship, okay? And I think that the summertime is going to be very popping for this particular relationship, Earth signs. So... If you're a cross watcher, I think the cross watchers, that's why this is coming up on the earth sign. So earth sign, if this doesn't resonate for you, if just your partner doing this, then there may be a lot of cross watcher energy coming through because I'm getting that some of you are dealing with an earth sign who's stuck between two people or who's still hesitating on a connection. All right. The lover's card in the outcome does signify, though, it can go either way because it can mean that this person also has a choice, too. But I'm not getting that. They're not getting the two of wands. They're happy with the six of wands because of this offer you made them, earth signs. Or the earth sign is happy because of the offer that they received, okay? So this is your um, energy for the month of June. It looks good if you want a commitment, okay? I do think that there's going to be an offer made, but there's still going to be a need for some work done to make that offer a little bit more legit. I would have liked to see that Page of Pentacles be the Knight of Cups, but we're not here yet. So maybe someone's mentioning marriage or mentioning an offer of commitment, but there's still going to be some hesitancy on someone's part here. All right, we've got a Romance Angel card, Children. Maybe that's why your love life is being affected by children. So maybe someone has children with someone and they're not ready to just jump out on a limb here because they have children. This could be the earth sign who has a child with someone and maybe they're trying to make sure that this transition is smooth. Or earth sign, it could be your partner who has children and maybe that's what's influencing why there's a bit of hesitation, which is understandable because children do need smooth transitions, especially if we're fit switching from a, a marriage to another partner or just switching from one partner to another. So children could be um, a big factor here for you all right this also could be someone you have children with or someone that you will have children with in the future okay an earth sign child is coming up in particular so some of you may have a Capricorn child uh, or a Taurus child or a Virgo child okay so I hope that this helps you guys thank you so much for watching earth signs please leave a comment below if it resonates also cross watchers because y'all are all up in the business all right happy birthday to Taurus I know this is June but you guys may be watching this in May so uh, I will see you guys for the next reading, okay? Thank you so much. And if you need a personal, make sure you check out the link in the description, okay? Bye, Earth Signs.